This is a very unique wine today, the Domaine du Cows, 2009 Lalande Cavagnac Cahors. Um, so Cahors is a region in the southwest of France, just south of Bordeaux, along the, uh, the Lot River Valley. Um, this is actually where the Malbec grape comes from. Um, you know, we all know Malbec from uh, Argentina, but uh, Cahors has been growing Malbec for centuries, and uh, it does very beautifully in this region. Um, this wine is uh, from a very small estate, the Domaine de Cows, that have about 60-something acres. Um, uh, this particular wine comes from one of the old vine plots, the uh, Lalande Cavagnac on their estate. Uh, vines planted back in the 70s, so 30 plus years, years of age. So you get good deep roots, nice low yields, very concentrated, intense flavors. Um, you know, Malbec has those wonderful uh, black fruit flavors and intensity and uh, you know the, the the climate in uh, Cahors is just ideal for it um, brings out the intense fruit but it also uh, you know lets it lets it grow slowly because it's it's uh, fairly cool there so the grapes develop nicely they maintain their acidity and you get good firm tannins as well um, the wine gets aged 12 months in oak barrels 09, outstanding vintage. There's a really, really a nice nose on this wine. You know, the, the nose, it just covers like the whole spectrum. You got those wonderful sort of base notes from the, from the, um, you know, the black fruits and the, the earthy tones. And then you get those, those high toned uh, perfuming notes and like, black truffle notes and little sweet sort of black cherry notes in between. It's very inviting. <laughs> Real good intensity to this wine. Um, has a nice, nice core, but it's also got all the pieces. There's, um, you know, those, those fruity notes are there, sort of black plums, black cherries. But then I'm getting licorice. I'm getting those earthy tones, um, some, some little higher tones, sweet notes. Um, but then you're getting that wonderful acidity that just keeps everything lively balanced against some pretty firm tannins. Um, you know, without those other, without that acidity, the tannins would be, would feel like too much. With the, the acidity there and, the, and the, the concentration of fruit, you get a really good balanced wine that tastes sort of lithe and, uh, and together. Um, really uh, unique, very delicious something you can probably sell her for a number of years as well as enjoy now with uh, aeration, so enjoy.